Hello and welcome to this how tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to add animations and effectively use them in PowerPoint 2016. So if we hit F5 here, I'm going to go ahead and show you a preview of the animations that we have. So the idea here is to keep everything simple, everything clean, so nothing takes away from the presentation itself. And this method is a very nice way of doing that. We blur or fade out the text before it, and then we focus on the current bullet point that we're talking about, the one that we're focusing on. And this goes ahead throughout the entire PowerPoint, keeping it all consistent and uniform. So I guess I'll go ahead over here because this page doesn't have animations yet. And we want to go to the animations tab. And we can go ahead and make it appear or fade in something nice, clean, and simple. So I'll choose fade for our very first animation there. And after we do that, we want the next bullet point here to then fade in. But also, we want the previous bullet point to fade out. I usually don't like making them completely disappear in case someone wants to look back at whatever was on the previous bullet point. So we'll go ahead and hit fade there for our second bullet point. And we want to make sure that we have the animation pane open. So now it's open. And we're just going to go ahead and select our first bullet point again, the one that we want to blur or dim. And we're going to go ahead and add animation. If we change it where we did before, it will just override it. So we want to make sure we add a new animation to that. And then we go ahead to this drop down menu and we click start with previous. So now it will go ahead with the previous animation, which is exactly what we want. And this is the pattern we're going to follow. I'll do one more just so that we can get the point here. And we'll just do that. Select the previous one. And we're going to add animation. Instead of going back to the one before. So we've hit transparent. And we start with previous. And everything should be good. And one final touch, we'll select the last bullet point. We're going to want to add animation, transparency, and we're going to want to start that on click, not with previous. So we go ahead, boom, it fades out, the next one comes in, and then on click, it fades out. So this has been a How Tech Video tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.